Yes. Hi there guys and welcome back to more Planet of the Apes as a part of my Monday Night at the Movie series. We're going to continue from where we left off, so let's get into it. I suggest that you choose your words more carefully. You seem to forget that you are speaking to the supreme leader of the Apes Council. You are to adopt a more moderate tone. Of course, Doctor. Here's Dr. Zeth. But I was simply saying that this human could provide an unexpected opportunity that may never occur again. Furthermore... How can I make you see reason? You chimpanzees seem to be so absorbed by your research work that you can no longer see the forest through the trees. I beg your pardon, Dr. Zayas, but I am just trying to make you understand. You seem to fear a danger that simply does not exist. And I would like to know exactly why this research is such a cause of worry to the central power and the orangutans. This discussion has gone on long enough, Doctor. Are you got to go into and a few unusual experiments, but nothing remotely thought of. So we've got Dr. Zaius and Dr. Zira there. I want to find Cornelius. He was always my favourite in the original uh, Planet of the Apes film. I have looked carefully at the fire on this human specimen, and I am convinced that he is dangerous. Based on what? He was wearing a decontamination outfit when he was apprehended. Probably stolen from some careless chimpanzee like yourself. You may even have killed someone to get hold of it. Did you call for a check in the area where he was kept? What? No, but... But that was the first thing you should have done, Doctor. And I am astonished at your incompetence. No, I simply cannot allow an animal as dangerous as him to remain alive. And as such, he must be put down as quickly as possible. But you cannot do that! How dare you! I was simply saying... That's enough! You're going too far, Professor Zira. My decision is made. This human will be transferred tomorrow to the hominid monitoring unit at the Mandrill Militia Station and eliminated from there. Oh my god. Believe me, the Mandrill will enjoy its redemption for us. Dr. Zayas, this is outrageous! and an abuse of your authority. The discussion is over, Doctor, and my decision is final. And may I add that if you continue down this path of openly defying your superior's authority with your deranged conceits about human intelligence, that someone may decide to attach a different motivation for your experiments. And that, Dr. Zira, is treason. Oh, wow. He is... Definitely abusing his power. He is. One of my favourite things about Dr. Zaius was the uh, Simpsons episode where they had a Planet of the Apes musical and all the guys were just like, Dr. Zaius, Dr. Zaius. I guess this is where I'm going to come out in. A uh, yes. We've got something in the corner. As well as, you know. Ah, shit. Do I have to fight him? Hang on, how do I fight? Shit. How do I lock on target? Fuck. Oh. <laughs> Fuck. Now I've got to figure out. I probably should have just snuck out as soon as he uh as soon as he came in. I 
the question is, can I lock him in here? <laughs> hey, you. I'll take you on, Mr. Ape. Mr. Gorilla. That's right, fuck you. Don't know how I managed to. Uh, computers of no interest. I bet I didn't even have to fucking fight him, did I? Did I have to just press this com link? Fuck's sake. Got into a needless fight anyway. This is the prison. The fuck is that? I genuinely have no idea where I've got to go. I think this is about as far as I got in this game because it was so damn hard. Shit. I think we're in kind of in the clear. Like I say, I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, fucking hell. Pretty sure that's where I started. Balls. Fuck, you see me. That's a turn and I fight him. Why do you run off? Come on, fucking piece of shit. What fucking you're a piece of shit, no. Get your stinking paws off me, you damn dirty ape. Eh? fuck out of two well, that's three apes now isn't it one unintentionally and another well another two intentionally because they were gonna fuck me up oh he's asleep door pass I'm surprised that guy didn't hear all the fighting I now have to find where this other door is. Is it this door? I'm going to say it's this door. I have a fucking key card. Thank you. Alright. Where are we? Okay. Through here it is. What's all this? I have a, a knife. Okay. We're about to fuck somebody up. I'll use that one. Now I have to find where the fuck I've got to go. Anyone want an arena fight? Aha! Uh -huh. Ho ho! Got a whole. Oh, yes, here we go. We are in the sewers and, well, one thing you should know is that apes hate water. Oh, well, that didn't work, did it? Okay. For fuck's sake, why did going up, pressing up on the D-pad, make him walk down? 
Okay, there we go, that's what we wanted. Well, okay, so that is it for episode two of Plans of the Apes. As always, guys, thank you for watching. If you have any feedback for me, please leave it in a comment below. And if you want to keep up to date with everything that I'm doing, including more Planet of the Apes as a part of my Monday Night of the Movie series, then please subscribe, and I'll see you next time.